In today's video, I'll give you 12 icebreakers to help kids get to know one another in a fun way. Research shows that laughter helps kids get to know one another by reducing stress and lowering the risk of meeting new people. Hello, I'm Shauna Powell, mom of two and former church educator. Welcome to my channel. Let's get into today's video. The first icebreaker is called emoji feelings. Ask your kids, how are you feeling today? And they can pop an emoji in the Zoom chat or draw an emoji on paper and show their paper to the camera. Icebreaker number two, pop-up story. Instruct your kids to make up a one minute story using an object within their reach. This little house right here is within my reach. Once upon a time, there was a princess who lived in a house, but she was no ordinary princess because she was tiny. <laughs> Icebreaker number three, if I had a million dollars, ask your kids what would they do if they had one million dollars? <laughs> I feel like I was channeling um, um, uh, Dr. Evil off of Austin Powers. If you know what I'm talking about and you're old like I am, let me know in the comment section down below. Number four is called collaborative story. Start with once upon a time, every kid gets a chance to add a one sentence to your story and create the most awesome story together. Number five, share a dad joke. <laughs> Ask your kids to share their best joke. I can never think of a dad joke. My husband, on the other hand, he has some pretty awesome dad jokes. Describe yourself. Instruct your kids to use three to five adjectives that positively describe themselves. Self-portrait. Instruct kids to draw a portrait of themselves on paper and then show that paper to the class. Give them one minute to talk about why they drew themselves the way they did. Rank it. Rank 10 things from best to worst. Instruct kids to use the Zoom polls or their pen and paper to rank a category of items from best to worst. For example, pizza toppings, Disney movies, or Taylor Swift songs, or ice cream flavors. Random question of the day. Ask kids a random question and to respond with one to three sentences. They can type it in chat or type it or write it, not type it on a sheet of paper, write it on a sheet of paper. An example would be, who is the most fun person you know and why? What food could you eat every single day and why? What is one place you would like to visit and why? Classic show and tell. Ask kids to bring a random object that they would like to share with the rest of the group and to explain why they wanna share it. But set, give them a time limit. Say they only have one or two minutes to talk about the object. Number 11 is get to know me. Not me, but you. Not you, but kids. <laughs> Instruct kids to write three to five sentences about themselves. They could write it on paper or write it in the chat on Zoom and then to share that with the rest of the group. And number 12 is one of my personal favorites. It's called Bigfoot on the Bus. Set the scenario up. Kids are getting ready to hop on the school bus and they find out, they discover that Bigfoot is on the bus. <gasps> Tell kids they can only bring one thing with them on the bus and then they have to explain what they brought and why they brought it. It was so awesome hanging out with you today. I'm Sean M. Howell, and I think that you will also like this video right here to watch after this one. I'll see you in my next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.